Unit Six. Choosing a mate. Vocabulary task. Connect the first part of each sentence with the second part. Discuss any words or phrases you don't know. Now listen and check your answers. I know he's the one. He's ready for a lifetime commitment. He is someone I can really trust. I had doubts at first about their relationship. He was divorced once already, but wanted to try again. Then I discovered that we like the same things. She swept me away with her personality. She has a great sense of humor. She's easy to talk to and fun to be with. And she's my type. Listening task. Look at the four people. What do you think they are like? First listening. What do these people say about themselves? One. Hi, I'm Michael. I'm a 32-year-old white male. I'm divorced, and I want to try again with the right lady. I like bodybuilding, rock music, dancing, and I like to party. I'm looking for an attractive woman who likes the same things I do, and she's got to be someone I can trust. Two. I'm Anita, and I'm a 34-year-old. African American single professional with a major corporation. I'm also very involved with the environmental organization Greenpeace. I'm looking for an African American single professional man who already has his own life, but wants to share quality time. He has to be honest above all else. Three. Hi, my name is Jack. I'm a sensitive 28-year-old guy. I'm ready for someone who wants a lifetime commitment. I'm into bodybuilding, movies, and surfing. I have a great job with a good income, so you don't have to be rich; just fun to be with, and you have to be able to cook. Four. My name is Cora, and I'm a single Chinese American woman. I'm in my mid twenties. If you love long walks on the beach, candlelight dinners, and intelligent conversation, I'd like to meet you. I want a man who comes from a good family, likes to read, and has a good sense of humor. Real world listening. Predict. Amy is talking about her fiance Luis. What do you think she likes about him? Now listen and check your prediction. I know I have a picture of Luis around here somewhere. Oh, here it is! Wow, he's so handsome. He looks like a Greek statue. Yeah, he is very attractive, but I didn't think so when I first met him. You didn't? No. You know what I noticed when I first met him? He has really hairy hands. <laughs> <laughs> What? Yeah, his hands are just really hairy. Plus, his clothes were way more fashionable than I usually like. He just wasn't my type. And on top of all of that, he was shorter than me. So how come you went out with him? Well, he was just really sweet and funny, and I was so comfortable just hanging out with him. And the first time we went out, he just swept me away with his personality. Really? How? He was just really easy to talk to. But still, if all those things bothered you about his hands and all, well, you know, none of that was important once I got to know him more. His personality and the way we got along just made it clear to me that he is the one. So, when's the big day? Language awareness, relative clauses. Listen and write the missing words. 
You know, I don't think this relationship is going to work out. I want someone who likes watching TV, but she wants someone who likes reading novels. I want someone who goes dancing every night, but she wants someone she can go to museums with. I want someone who has a lot of money, but she wants someone who doesn't care about things like that. And here's the biggest problem. I want someone who just wants to have fun, but she wants someone she can trust. I don't think I'm the right guy. Unit 6. Self-study. Listen to the conversation. Correct the errors in the script. I know I have a picture of Luis around here somewhere. Oh, here it is. Wow, he's so handsome. He looks like a Greek statue. Yeah, he is very attractive. But I didn't think so when I first met him. You didn't? No. You know what I noticed when I first met him? He has really hairy hands. <laughs> <laughs> what? Yeah, his hands are just really hairy. Plus, his clothes were way more fashionable than I usually like. He just wasn't my type. And on top of all of that, he was shorter than me. So how come you went out with him? Well, he was just really sweet and funny, and I was so comfortable just hanging out with him. And the first time we went out, he just swept me away with his personality. Really? How? He was just really easy to talk to. But still, if all those things bothered you, about his hands and all... Well, you know, none of that was important once I got to know him more. His personality and the way we got along just made it clear to me that he is the one. So, when's the big day? Language Awareness Relative Clauses Listen and write the missing words. You know, I don't think this relationship is going to work out. I want someone who likes watching TV, but she wants someone who likes reading novels. I want someone who goes dancing every night, but she wants someone she can go to museums with. I want someone who has a lot of money, but she wants someone who doesn't care about things like that. And here's the biggest problem. I want someone who just wants to have fun, but she wants someone she can trust. I don't think I'm the right guy.